We're in Windows Server 2019 in Active Directory. I'm going to show you how to reset a person's password. So we go to Tools and we go to Active Directory Users and Computers. You can also reset the administrator password this way as well, but we'll just show it on a user. So let's say Sally's password needs to be changed. So we'll right click on it and choose Reset Password. And then we'll put in our new password, make sure it conforms to the password requirements of the organization. And if the person has uh, tried to use the password too many times and it's locked up the account, then you can see that it will show up as locked here and you can check the box for unlocking the user account. However, that's not the case, so we won't worry about it. And we'll click OK. Now, the other thing you want to check after you change the password is the account tab. So if you double click on the user's account, click on the account tab, you want to make sure that this is set up the way that you want to. We see that the password never expires button is, is checked. However, you may not want to do that. So if you uncheck the box, then it will require that you change your password every 45 days or 90 days or whatever the group policy setting is. You can also say the user cannot change the password must change the password and next log on. This is typically done for a new user where the administrator knows the password and uh, you want to have the user reset it to something that you don't know. So that way the administrator doesn't end up knowing that user's password. So that is how you reset a password using Windows Server 2019 Active Directory.